Hey, what's up? This is Dream Team. Team. Oh, oh, and you're watching Mahala.co.za. Stay tuned. Where are they? Where did you last see them? I last saw something res resembling Nigeria. Over, over there. Are they they look super cool. They were like dogs and like really. What, what were they wearing? They were wearing fur coats. Um, I think uh, it's been an adjustment, obviously, you know, coming into the industry is never an easy thing when you have to kind of live a life that you're not used to. But thanks to God, you know, we've been fortunate enough to be blessed with so much work. We've been placed with the right people, we've been placed with the right artists, um, we've been involved in the right music. So I think for us, we're, we're, we're not really noticing the, the bad parts. Well, it's not bad parts because we don't notice it. But, you know, we wake up when we wake up when we have to and we go do what we do because we love it. My favorite winner tonight, Diamond killed it. He raked in a lot of awards. But I gotta give it up to the man, Casper. It has been his year. He's been working so hard. He's been chasing this dream forever. And like, yeah, he deserves it. He's my favorite winner for tonight. Uh, my other favorite winner, I could see how much it meant to, to Donald. So, um, and the fact that I presented that award was pretty cool to, to give it to him, especially because he was so happy about it. I actually thought David O was gonna win and he actually didn't win. I thought that was so weird. Because in the other award shows, he pretty much walks away with everything. I would have loved to see David O win something. Because David O and, and Pato ranking. I was hoping David O would, would rake in a couple of awards. Ah, uh, man, I just like I like Casper, man. He's like South African talent. He's pushing really, really hard. But um, shout out to Pato. We met him earlier on this week and he's very, very good as well. The soul people between Casper and that other dude, that other colored dude, as he says. Or AKA, as bad as people might think it is, it's healthy for the game. Like hip hop isn't all like roses, flower petals and fairies. If it was like, if it was like that, it would be pretty boring. There has to be beef, there has to be a bit of controversy to like keep the game going. Like look at it, Casper swept out like the whole floor. Like he was the main winner in the whole of Africa. So like beef kind of does pay off for these rappers. It's needed for the game when you actually think of it. God damn go Oyenza Masimba. Why are you doing this to us? Turn around, let them see what I'm talking about. Can I just say for one, okay? Yeah. When I live my life, I'm not gonna be 26 my whole life. Yes, I've said my age. Two, you need to be daring and take risks in life, whether it's in your profession or your personal life. And three, you're welcome. <laughs> Oh, it always gets crazier, crazier, and less and less. So one day I'm gonna be walking naked on this thing. <laughs> I mean, yeah, what's up? Are you are you a nudist or something? I'm a big nudist. So, are you, would you go to the the new nudist beach in Kaiserin? Oh yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I might go for like a week or so, actually, in December. Oh, I. You clearly not conservative. No. Right, but to the other, let's say to the people who are conservative and look at you and like, and say all these nasty words. You know, um, what you gotta say to those people? For me, I believe in living your own life and your own destiny and staying your own lane. I feel like when people are quick to judge others, I think they need to reflect on who they are and where they are in their lives because when you're really flowing in life and having good things come to you or you're preoccupied yeah. in, in your greatness and your purpose, you actually don't have time to look at someone else and say, you know what I mean? Yeah. You actually so focused, it's almost, this is how it is. When you live in your purpose, this is how life should be. And if you have time to point a finger, I will see you at Judgment Day when I'm chilling with the OG. All right, stand. Yes. What's going on? I go by the name of Miss Denise Vuzu Extra. Let me start. Right. Start again. Can I start that again? Yeah. It's been a long night. All right. What's up, guys? I'll go by the name of Miss Denise Zimba, a Vuzu presenter, Generations Actress. What's up, y'all? 